it's Jump Ray here, and welcome to my video game creation showcase. So recently, my school announced this competition thing from this organization called WCS, or something like that, where the task was to, in simple terms, do something to benefit the lives of others. So clearly the task set was purposefully extremely vague to allow each participant to have a wide range of options to choose from. The competition started back in like April or May or something, but I didn't start until the 17th of May. So personally I only had like 4 weeks to make something, so I decided to create a video game. Nice. I finished coding it like 2 days ago, and then I made this here game trailer. So. Let's watch it together now, shall we? And I'll be your guide on this coding adventure, 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 adventure. So that was a short trailer I made for my game, What the Tinker. Uh, the game has six levels and is targeted at people who are curious about how video games are made. Um, the game assumes no prior knowledge or expertise, so please don't feel like you have to be like a computer science genius or anything to play this game. Uh, whoever you are, I'm absolutely certain that this game will be accessible to you. So I could explain now exactly what the video game is and exactly what it contains for the rest of this video. But the best way to experience this game is just to play it, and all you need to play it is a Mac or Windows computer. So now I'm just going to explain how to install it for each operating system. So for Mac, playing the game is super easy. Just go to this video's description and click the link that will be around here. Uh, this link will download this file, and then to play the game just double click this file, and that will cause this folder to appear, and then the game is right here in this folder, and you can double click it and play it. And that's all there is to it for Mac. To install the game for Windows, first check this part of the video's description. If a link exists here, click it and you'll find an easier method to install this game for Windows. If there's no link here, continue watching and I'll explain the main standard method for installing this game for Windows. Installing the game on Windows requires 5 steps. Step 1. Download the archive file listed in this video's description. Step 2. Unpack the archive file. Step 3, install Python. Step 4, install Pygame. Step 5, execute the correct Python script to activate the game. So, first of all, click this link in the description, and this will cause this file to be downloaded. Step 2, right click the file, and click extract here. This will cause this folder to be created with all the components you'll need to play the video game. If there's no extract here option, you'll need to download and install WinRAR. To do so, click this link, then this button here. This will cause this WinRAR installer file to be downloaded. To install WinRAR, just double click this, click yes. 
and then just continually click yes until it installs. Once when WinRAR is installed, you'll have this option available to you. And you'll be able to use it to, oh, this one here, and you'll be able to use it to extract the folder you need. Nice. Next, we need to install Python. To do so, click this link here. Then click, oh, then click this button to download the Python installer. Oh, this will cause this file to be downloaded. Next, just double click on this file. Oh, there we go. And click on install anyway. you want to click this button here. It's very important to make sure you do that. And then you click this button here. Great, now let's install Pygame. To do so, just push the Windows key and R. This will cause this window to appear, and then just type CMD, and then click enter. And this will cause this window to appear. Then just type pip install pygame, and then click enter. And then there we go, we've got Hi game, yay. It didn't work, it's probably because you didn't click the tick box next to the path, which I told you to earlier, um, but that's okay. You can probably fix this issue by um, checking out this tutorial in the description and this person ought to help you out with that. Um, but even if you did tick it, sometimes it doesn't work. If not, I'm, yeah, I'm sure this tutorial will be able to help you get Pi game installed. Great, now close the command line. And we're nearly there guys, one more step. So for this final step, just open the folder we created earlier. And then just double click this file kit called run game file. And video games, yay, we did it. And now you just play the game, woo. So running this file should work 100% of the time, but somehow, if running this script didn't work, uh, the fix for this is super simple. Uh, just right click the file called main instead, and select open with, and then select the first option. And there we go. Just clicking OK to these pop-ups here should... Um, should cause everything to work just as it should do. Good job! Alright viewers, so I know I said earlier that I would explain why the installation for Windows is so slow um, in terms of the problems, uh, the technical problems I got into, but um, I'm so exhausted right now, I'm like literally um, this cat right now. Um, because I've been pretty much editing uh, yesterday and today non-stop to get this video done for the deadline tomorrow. So um, instead of explaining my technical issues verbally, um, I'm just going to write them down. So you'll be able to find a link to that in the description if you're interested in why Pi2EXE didn't work as it should have. Um, and yeah. So that was my video game creation showcase. So thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you guys later.